players get more nervous than the rookies because they know what well, how tough it is, huh? Oh, boy. He just sends <laughs> it up to the heavens, doesn't he? <laughs> now, that was a how it's a shot there. We're all three. Bird spots Ainge open, but he has nowhere to go. McHale with a good bounce. Two very good bounces for the Celtics. One by Robert Parrish and the other one just now by Kevin McHale. His go here in the first quarter. Larry, and another good Celtic bounce. And see, that, that's a tough shot, but you have to go inside. That's McHale. Hubbard went for the steal and paid the price. You don't do that against a great player. Five points for Bird. And the Celtics. And they have played the Celtics tough, even though they lost all six of the regular season games. They played them tough the last two. And there's a fine effort by Bird on the pass from Johnson. Seven Perfect. points for Larry. 35 seconds to go. Cleveland will get the last shot of the quarter. Larry Bird makes sure that the Celtics get the last shot with a quick one with 33, 31 seconds to go. Bird also has nine, but still not really here. being able to turn things on. They got a little excited on the last trip down. That'll perk him up. Break him up. 11 for Larry. Tied at 44. We Six. Make well, this game was, was being played back uh, <laughs> in Cleveland. The crowd noise and level will be a lot higher. That was a great pass by Dennis Johnson to Bird, who snuck underneath. And we're tied at 50. 4.50 to go in the first. Celtics by four. We've got 3.25 to go in the half. Bird makes it six-point lead for the Celtics. 15 points for Larry Bird. And this is what happens when you... That basket take that commanding lead. Now it's a seven-point lead, and the free-throw penalties have really hurt. Great pass, a great cut, and great shot. Sounds like a great play to me. It sounds like it. <laughs> As simply you, you, you got close already, Rick. <laughs> trailing, trailing by nine points. Oh, yes. Count the basket. Excellent play by Dennis Johnson. He had a wide open jump shot, and so many players get the blinders on and never see the open <laughs> men. But uh, that time, McHale was wide open under the basket. That's one thing you can't do on this team. Turn your head. And that's no, what I mean. Uh, Ignore when the one the guys is open. See, there's a defense reaction right there. It's so wide open. And Hubbard was pushing off on Bird, but he went to the basket. That was the guy. If you were Boston, that's the guy you were put. Oh, what a collision underneath! Edgar Jones hit the deck, and Bird pops one in, standing on the three-point line. Twenty-six points for Larry Bird. And again, the action is getting hot. Larry Bird hits the deck and scores. George oh, Carl wants a timeout. Boston back up by 12 points at the 5-10 mark, third quarter. <laughs> 14 points. 13 points. Bird couldn't get it, but Parrish keeps it alive. Great pass. And a smart move. Cut. Yes. 30 points for Larry Bird. Point lead for Cleveland. And that hurts. They're going to count that basket. Continuation is what yeah, you, well, you have like, to call a continuation. Looked like he may have put it on the floor after the foul. Of course, you're not allowed to do that. But the basket counts for Larry Bird. Let's, Let's see. see if we can take a look at it. Now, there's, a, there's one foul. There's another there's one right there's there. there. No, he didn't. The foul, and he had he had already put it on the floor in the continuation. So a great effort by Larry Bird. He's got 32 points, make it 33. Both teams relatively low turnovers. Three pointer, Bird count it. Five point lead for Boston at the 6:20 mark. Larry Bird with 36 points. Time, and here's where the experience of the Celtics should pay off. We'll see. Bird to two good to pass to get, to get the layup. 19 for Kevin McHale. It's a two-point lead. Look your way out on the road. Hubbard against Bird. Harry Bird gets the Celtics to lead by one. 2.18 to go. 40 points for Larry Bird.